Welcome back to the SMT YouTube channel. Wanted to share this with you, uh, some speed tests here from the Verizon 5G Ultra Wideband Network. My friend Chucky is over at the Blink-182 concert, and he sent these over to me. And it looks like he is indeed connected to the millimeter wave bands. And, man, you know, <laughs> this network connection screams. A perfect use case for millimeter wave concert venues. You know, NFL stadiums, baseball stadiums, anywhere where you got tens of thousands of people. I mean, it, I mean, can you think of a better use case, right? So Verizon has kind of become the large venue provider. You know, you think about the networks that have the most capacity, that are able to do the most with the assets that the network builders have. You just think about Verizon, all right? NBA arenas, uh, uh, NHL, it's them. You know, if they've got millimeter wave, on CRAN or the nodes or small cells, whatever the situation may be. Multiple gigabits per second, just immense amounts of capacity, uplink for days. You know, so you look at this speed test, I think from his iPhone, I think he has a 16 Pro Max, maybe possibly he upgraded to the 17 gen, but uh, you know, you see nice pings, nice and low, uh, the jitter, very low, 3.5 gigs down, 141 meg up. So there's that speed test, here's another one. 3.7 gigs down 236 megabits per second up i think he's in the st louis market and i'm not sure if that's ericsson or samsung maybe you guys can tell me but those are good really good performances you know to be at a packed concert and to still have that kind of throughput you know you think about live streaming you think about sharing videos with your friends being able to do that kind of in the live and sharing those moments you know the the, just the network keeps cooking, you know, and now with Verizon kind of dabbling with the standalone 5G and voice over NR, you know, the, the voice calling over 5G, you know, it's all kind of coming together. And then at this location, they probably still have the mid band available too, right? N77 with the C band. So, you know, a real layer cake when they do things like this, you know, you got your, all of your assets deployed, you can do special things. So this is exciting. And you know, really cool that he shared this with me, and I, I'm guessing, you know, this is doing like four gigabits plus, you know, when it's not on, when it's not loaded. But man, that is that is tons of capacity. Maybe in its peak, this might, you know, <laughs> get down to a gigabit per second. Maybe, but pretty amazing what you could do with some high capacity fiber, millimeter wave nodes, and some good engineering. Anyways, let me know what you guys think of that performance. If you have Verizon and you've been connecting to Millimeter Wave, how's that been? Uh, is that one of the reasons why you choose Verizon? Is it situations like this? Because very typically at these types of concerts, AT&T and T-Mobile don't really always hold up too well, right? And and I think it's just a testament to Verizon's, you know, 5G build out with the Millimeter Wave asset. But go ahead and drop me some, some comments. Excited to read what you guys have to say. Like, share, subscribe. Check out some more videos. We'll see you guys soon on the next one.